In August of 2021, as U.S. forces neared completion of their withdrawal from Afghanistan, Yalda Royan was looking for a way out. And shooting started inside the city and people started running and calling on me like, go soon home because um, the Taliban has entered Kabul. The militant regime swept back into power as U.S. forces departed. Royan knew she did not want to live under the regime's oppressive rules, which drastically restrict the rights of women. Right now, being a woman in Afghanistan is like being a bird inside a cage. Um, they cannot get out of the home. They don't have the freedom of movement. Um, it's just a hell. She and her two daughters managed to escape to the United States. Now, almost a year and a half later, she's part of a group of displaced Afghan women using art to help tell their stories. Yes, we have been evacuated here, but there are 30 million people inside Afghanistan who are hostages and in the hands of Taliban. Voice, a nonprofit that advocates for female refugees around the world, helped put the exhibit together. Royan works with them and hopes this display shows the world the brighter future for Afghanistan that she dreams of. A day that the Taliban are gone, my country is in peace and women are leaving there, enjoying their rights and they can shine in every uh, area that they want. At the National Mall, Zach Merchant, WUSA 9.